was not filming. It wasn't. I have to start over. You said this one. I pointed to this. Sorry. All right. Hi everybody, as some of you know, I spend a lot of my time um, in Cambridge, Massachusetts, but I spend a few weeks out of the year always in Montego Bay, in Jamaica, um, that's my home, and I, there are a few things I always have to get whenever I come home, either to carry back or whenever I'm here, and I just want to share some of them with you, and for those of you that are in Jamaica, um, I'm going to share some of the things that I just, I hope that you guys try to support Jamaican businesses and that type of thing. So, um, it's food items and some of them is cosmetics and uh, hopefully um, you can give me some feedback and tell me if you try any of them. So, um, this is Caribbean Passion Jerk Sausage. I like to use this um, with cornbread to stuff like roast chicken sometimes. Um, I like, because it's, um, it has a lot of fat in it, um, I just sometimes I just put it in the oven or I just um, sear it in a skillet. And um, because I don't eat a lot of meat sometimes, I just kind of just do some large cuts of this and I just use it to flavor um, like soup or whatever um, legume dish I might be eating. And it's very, very flavorful. It's just as you'd use it in the same way as um, you use chorizo or andouille sausage. Um, you can eat it for breakfast. It's not too spicy, but the but it's very, very balanced. All of the spices are balanced and it's a great, great buy. Um, another thing, um, I got a few things from this place, so I'll just stick to that pharmacy for now. Um, I bought some things from Clinicare Pharmacy um, <laughs> at Witter Village, and this is um, mango pepper jelly. I use it to flavor popcorn, um, and sometimes I use it for, um, for smoked salmon sandwiches, I use it to make glaze for roasted meats, and um, it's a perfect, perfect um, thing to use to just add a little bit of extra flavor because it's sweet and it's spicy because it has scotch bonnet peppers and um, very concentrated uh, mango in it. Um, another, the next few things I got from Clinic here, um, I got. These LA Girl um, concealers, the coverage is amazing. It's as good as any high-end concealer. Um, and they're very, very cheap. They're about 300 and something dollars each. I like to use them for contouring, and um, I'm going to have a lot of fun with these. Um, also, I really, really love when my place smells very good. Um, oh, they're 300, and I'm, whenever I use currency, I'm using Jamaican dollars. Um, uh, in the description bar below, I'll put the exchange rate, um, but it's about, what, like $2 and something in American. Very cheap. Um, then, uh, this is a candle from Starfish Oils. I really am a fan of their um, aromatherapy products. I am a stickler for my place smelling good. I like to come home, light a candle, drink some wine, listen to some music, and unwind after a long day, and this always gets the job done. Um, okay. Other food items. I got these two things from Mega Mart, um, the same place I got this sausage, um, and I got this um, sorrel um, honey wine. It's effervescent, um, it's sweet, but it's so good um, and refreshing. Uh, I like to use a little lime in there, um, and it's just a cute little size, like a nice little half bottle. Um, sometimes I just mix it with a little ginger beer or um, soda water if I just want um, a less, uh, a more, what do I call this, more, like a not as hard soil flavor, but I still want to get like a hint of it, you know, just like a little taste. Um, but yeah, definitely try this. I don't remember the price for this, but it's, um, what I'm showing you most of these, the food items are products at Jamaica. And I am a big, 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 big supporter of, so, um, of supporting Jamaicans. So if you can, try and buy these things. And the last thing, the bottle is empty for a reason. Calico rum punch. Sometimes it's a little weak, so I like to put in a little bit of the Appleton special in it to, you know, like, you know, lift it up a little bit. Yeah, and it tastes, it tastes very good. It, it don't really have like the bitters, like traditional rum punch supposed to have bitters, but um, for something that sell in the supermarket, Calico, 
calico around it. Next. Um, okay, so I got these at Wita Village too, but not at Clinic here. These are from um, the perfume store down there. They sell Black Up Cosmetics, which are exclusively. They're, it's a French brand um, made for women of color, mostly. Um, and their range in foundation is great. They have these sublime powders that I'm going to save up for because they are amazing and they give your skin this wicked crazy glow. Their foundation products, if you can try them, try them. These are um, 25 US dollars each. They are so pigmented. I'm just going to do a quick swatch of both on my fingertips so you can see what I'm talking about. Is that focusing? Okay, good. So, yeah. And that's just me just lightly touching it like... You know, it's amazing. Next, and the last thing actually is um, uh, this Ateneo. This is also a Jamaican brand and it's um, for here. Like, you know, I don't know about my, my edges. I don't wear weave or anything, but I put in braids like years ago and the edges then still are struggle. So, I'm depending on Ateneo to restore my hairline to its days of former glory. This is Scalp Restore. I mean, authentically Jamaican. <laughs> All right, it's made with um, castor oil, moringa oil, tea tree oil, which really does help to stimulate hair growth. I don't like the smell though. The tea tree oil just do it don't do nothing for me. Make me sneeze, but that's besides the point. Anyway, um, that is my Jamaica haul. I am hurrying to catch a plane right now, so peace. And see you on Need for Read.